Coming up, I'll show you why this source of drinking water for more than 200,000 people may soon be at risk. Water. It's the essence of humanity. We need it to clean ourselves, to feed our crops, to survive. Clean water is essential to every single society. America has traditionally been lucky not to have to worry about their water quality. But that might not be the case anymore for the city of Birmingham. A mining company has obtained the permission from the state to mine for coal on the Mulberry Fork of the Black Warrior River, next to a drinking water intake for 200,000 Birmingham residents. It would just be pretty devastating, and who knows for how long. Nelson Brook patrols the Black Warrior River on the lookout for threats and hazards to the river that supplies the majority of the drinking water to Tuscaloosa and Birmingham. He says that the mine's proximity next to the drinking water intake of the Birmingham Waterworks would pose major problems with Birmingham's clean drinking water. Now, we and the Birmingham Water Works Board are concerned about what the, the permit actually allows to start with. But if they had an accident and they broke their permit limits and went above them and discharged more pollution than they're allowed to in the river, once it's in the river, it's right next to the drinking water source intake. The proposed mine would discharge pollution from 29 different points into the river around the drinking water intake, including at one point directly across from the drinking water intake. Environmental attorney Eva Dillard has said she has talked to scientists who are surprised that such a mine was permitted in the first place. They state that in all of their time during research, they have never seen uh, a surface mine uh, you know, across from a drinking water intake. It's unprecedented in, the, in their experience. It's important to note that while the land has been approved for mining at Shepherd's Bend, the land has not yet been leased by a landholder for mining purposes. Who owns the land at Shepherd's Bend, you ask? The University of Alabama. Brooke and Dillard promise to continue to petition the university until it publicly comes out and says that it will not lease the land for mining purposes. For the University of Alabama, I'm Jay McSlayer reporting.